Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to another episode of Bobcats in Bushes. Today's episode comes to you from one of our field reporters, Rabonki Blaber, and she'll be talking about our uh, amazing friends, the domestic rabbit. That's why today's episode, Bunny Edition. Let's go! Good morning, Burnley Moran Bobcats, and welcome to this special edition, morning meeting edition, of Bobcats and Bushes, apartment style. Today, we will get to take a closer look at the domesticated house rabbit in the apartment during this uh, quarantine time. So we'll get to take a look at his different habits, uh, such as what he likes to eat, where he sleeps, what, who his natural predators are, and where he likes to hang out for fun. Also, I want you to be using your imagination and pretend that I'm talking in an Australian accent because I tried it earlier and I couldn't do it. And also, thank you for that fine introduction. Let's get started. All right, for our greeting this morning, if you have a nice furry friend nearby, you can say hi to them or you can say good morning. Good morning, Lulu. And um, maybe you can give them a headbutt. Give me a headbutt. Oh, thank you. That was very nice. And if you don't have a furry friend, maybe you could um, do something like that with a with a stuffed animal. Bonkers is here to demonstrate our physical challenge today, which is to walk on your hind legs. You ready? Up, up, walk, walk, walk. Very good. There he goes. Hello again, Bobcats. I'm Rabuki Blabber from Bobcats in Bushes, Apartment Edition. I have been foraging for um, gourds and for my dinner. And uh, now we're going to move to the educational portion of our show, where we will learn about the habits of the domesticated uh, apartment rabbit. Thank you. Oops. Oh no. Okay, here we see, whoops. Here we see the domesticated rabbit is being interrupted by also the domesticated cat enjoying his daily meal. Um, his best friend Lulu also likes to come and try to eat his meal every single day even though she knows that she does not like salads and she just will smell it and bother everyone and then go away. So um, Bonkers, you see here, is enjoying some kale. He has some fresh greens every day. And he also enjoys these pellets. They're Timothy hay based. And if you can see in the background, we have a bag here of Western Timothy hay, which is the staple and base of every domesticated apartment rabbit. Um, they eat a lot of hay every day. Lulu, you're not supposed to be eating his salad. You know that. Now we will visit the uh, domesticated house rabbit bonkers apartment within the apartment. If you can see behind me, this is his enclosure. He does not have a cage and he is actually litter box trained. So he um, has free run in the house. This is where he uses, this is his bathroom. And it's also where he eats his hay. A bit controversial, I know, not recommended. Um, but that's what rabbits do. This is also his um, den. He hangs out in a bag, but um, yeah, that's where he goes sometimes to feel safe. This is his stoop. It's also where his water bowl is to try to keep it away from Lulu. As you saw before, she likes to take his things and it does not work at all. And um, he has this little area where he can play, he can chew on things. Um, that is one thing. Bonkers does like to chew on things, so you've got to make sure that he has plenty of things to chew on other than phone chargers. As far as predators go, 
in the apartment, you would think it would be the cat, but as you saw earlier, she poses no threat. The greatest threat to Bonkers in the apartment is me, because he's so cute that I like to give him so many smooches, and he doesn't necessarily always enjoy it, but I'm also very careful to not squeeze him too much because he's so fuzzy. All right, we're about to wrap up our morning meeting because somebody has about had enough today. I'm not going to say who it is. We're going to end with our joke. It's a bunny-themed joke, of course. Bonkers. Uh, what do you call a group of bunnies hopping backwards? What do you think? What do you think it is? A receding hairline! <laughs> Bunny, he loved it. Alright, happy Friday, you guys. Good to see you, and have a great weekend. Bye!